welcome back to my channel. My name is Shayna, and if you're new here, welcome to my channel. Um, I hope you like and subscribe if you would like to see more of my face. So, today I wanna do some real talk, you guys. Um, I, I will admit it, I was a speedy hater. <laughs> I bought a Sienna MM as my first Louis Vuitton bag because I did not like the look of the Speedy and I did not like the slouch and I didn't understand why people loved it. Boy, was I wrong. <laughs> oh my goodness. Um, I recently purchased, we'll show you this gorgeous thing. I recently purchased, this is the Speedy B30 in the Damier of Ben, um, because I was losing my mind about the handles and the vaquetta. Uh, and this has slowly turned into, dare I say it, my favorite handbag. And I was a speedy hater. I did not understand it. I did not like it. I was very confused about it. Um, <laughs> I actually have a video up about the Speedy versus the Sienna and I did that video right after I purchased this bad boy and I said that I loved them both equally. I didn't like the slouch of this bag um, and that I had a purse organizer coming to me from original club and that I thought that I might like it better with the purse organizer. Let me talk to you guys. Let me just tell you that this purse organizer has changed my life. I'm not even kidding. Um, this is the bag that I go to if, so I have a Balenciaga at Balenciaga City. And I used to call that my Mary Poppins bag because I can fit a lot of stuff in that bag. And I still love it, don't get me wrong, I love it. It's my baby, I bought it in London when we were there um, at Harrods. And I love that bag, I just rocked it two days ago. But this is my new Mary Poppins bag. I can carry absolutely everything and the kitchen sink, maybe not the kitchen sink, but you know what I mean. I can carry everything in this bag it's amazing, I am absolutely in love with it. I feel like I'm a raving lunatic because I love this bag so much. I'm kind of pathetic. Um, let's get into why I enjoy this bag so much now. So, this bag, as you can see, has a purse organizer in it. It is no longer slouchy. See, it's all like heavy duty. There's actually a base shaper in here because I bought that first, thinking that the base shaper might solve my problem. So when I put the base shaper in here by itself, oh, I just love this bandeau. Um, when I put the base shaper in here by itself, this bag had a little more shape to it, but it became a black freaking pit. It was like I would put my wallet and my keys and my coin pouch and like I put all my stuff in there and you could fill it up. A, like there's a, there's a lot of room in this. Like it looks like luggage. Um, I could probably use it as an overnight bag, to be honest, without the organizer in here, because there's just so, you could put so much stuff in here. And for the first couple of weeks, I was kind of freaking out because I didn't really enjoy using it because I was always digging for stuff. I was like, where are my car keys? Where are my house keys? Where's my cell phone? Like, and I was like rummaging through this bag more than I was actually enjoying it. The big, like life changing um, event happened when I got my purse organizer and I will try to show you, let's see if this will happen, um, what it looks like in here with the purse organized. Uh, can you see it? I don't know. I'm gonna insert a picture because I took a really good picture of what this purse looks like with the organizer in it. Um, I bought my organizer from Original Club on Etsy. I was looking back and forth between like Samorga and a couple of other ones that were on Etsy and some that maybe were on Amazon. I wanted something with a lot of structure though. Um, and this seems to have a significant amount of structure. I do have the base shaper 
on the bottom. Um, and then I have the organizer that you can see like when it's open, you can see where that base shaper or the purse organizer ends. Um, oops, somebody is talking to me. So let me just show you what this puppy holds. Like this is literally my everything and the kitchen sink bag. So the first thing that I'm gonna pull out is my full size iPad. Ooh, I just dropped that. The full size iPad fits in there really nicely and it stays like this on its side um, and it stays in its little um, like slot, which is great. At the end of this, I'm gonna pull the, the um, organizer out so you can see what mine looks like because there are like several different versions that you could get. Um, so I'll show you which one I got. I actually got two and then I, I enjoy this one more, I think for my use. So that's the first thing that came out and that kind of just sits on one side. And then there's this like middle portion and I've got a full sunglasses case with sunglasses. I've got my Zippy multi cards for all of my extra miscellaneous credit cards that don't fit in my wallet and like all those little stamp cards and rewards cards and things like that. They go in this. And then on this side, I've got my mini pochette. And that just carries less of my junk drawer so that like my pens and my makeup and things like that don't like go over all over the place. Um, and then I've got a full size wallet. This happens to be the jean wallet from Louis Vuitton. So the full size wallet does fit with the purse organizer. And now I think that everything's out of the middle. I'm going to pull it out for you. Let me see if I can get it out here. Maybe, okay. So it comes out like that. I just kind of yanked it out and this is what it looks like. Um, I do, I will mention that in here, in this back zippered part is where I keep, the only thing I keep in there is my car key. So I have my car key and that just stays like right at the very top so that I don't have to go digging. Um, and then, oops, there's a Monopoly ticket. Okay, so this is basically what it looks like um, when it's out and on the four, there are four little pockets here. So I have my key clay, no, six ring key holder, um, which is amazing. And then I have, this is the key clay, this is where I keep my business cards right now. And then I have my change pouch and I have, this is where I keep all of my wires and charging things for my phone. I have my headphones in here. I have the dongle for my iPhone 7 because I don't have a headphone port in it. So that goes there. So I'll put the stuff back the way I usually hold it up. This actually is really cool. Um, some of them come with like a water bottle holder. This one actually has, it's removable, this middle. So if you want to just have the four and then a giant pocket in the bottom, you can, or you can put this cool thing in. You put it back in for you so that we can continue talking here. So if you put it in, put it in the right way. There we go. It looks like that. So you have more dividers. So I'll put the stuff back in. So I'm gonna put my wallet back in. I'm gonna put my Zippy multi carts back in and my mini pochette fits in there. And my sunglasses, where'd it go? Ah, and my iPad and it ends up looking like this. It's super cool. Um, if I had like the Neverfull, and I've actually pulled this out, I don't have a Neverfull. I, I'm not like the biggest tote bag person right now. Maybe I'll use one as like a baby bag when I have kids, I don't have kids yet. Um, I'm not the biggest tote person, but I do have an older coach tote that my husband bought for me because he insists that my favorite color is pink, so he brought me a bright pink coach tote at, some, at one point is very cute. Um, so I rock that um, whenever I want a tote. I actually put that this in there um, and I could then move the iPad to like this big slot here so that I have more room for other things over here. Um, but I don't do that because it's hard to get to this in the speedy because it's like right up on the edge of the bag. So I don't use this very much. I have 
split like a put like a receipt or something in there but I kind of just forget that this that this pocket exists um, the other bag I have doesn't have this middle divider or the bag the other organizer I have doesn't have the middle part it has like a water bottle holder um, and then it has pockets on the outside so and one pocket over here so there are lots of different options for purse organization and this makes my super organized heart happy I love it I love it I love it so much um, <laughs> I I will tell you that I'm a speedy convert. I love the way this fits in the bag. Um, I, I mean, it does get heavy because I have now put absolutely everything but the kitchen sink. If I wanted to put a water bottle, where's my water bottle? If I wanted to put a water bottle in here, there you are, I could definitely do it. See, even a water bottle fits in there. So I could definitely put a water bottle. I could put other things. Um, I know a lot of people have like organizers if you wanted to put an organizer there's still massive amounts of room in here like there's plenty of room to put other things there's other space um, in here so it really just just depends on what you use um, in your purse it's this is my everything and the kitchen sink bag it's the bag that I go to if I'm gonna be out all day long and I'm gonna need absolutely everything that I can think of I can even, when this is in the bag, if I wanted to put like a light sweater on top of this and put it in the bag, that would also fit in there because there is space between where the purse organizer ends and the top of the bag because the bag rounds. So the bag shaper organizer goes to about there and then the bag like rounds. So there's plenty of space. Um, like up here, if you just want to shove like a light sweater or something, not like a big bulky one, but like a simple light sweater. Anyway, I am a convert. I know that there are a lot of people out there that were like me that were like, nah, no speedy. Like it's a black hole, it's slouchy. I'm not a fan of the slouch. I'm very classic lines. Um, I don't have any hobo bags at, this, at the moment. Um, all my bags are really structured and I very much I much, much, much prefer the Speedy with an organizer. I was kind of freaking out because I was worried about, you know, did I get the right bag, you know, because I had hesitated for so long buying the Speedy. And then after I had it, when I didn't have the purse organizer in it, I was freaking myself out because I wasn't enjoying it. And now with this purse organizer, I can confidently say that this is my favorite bag. At, the point, at this moment, anyway, <laughs> right now, this is my favorite bag, and not that my other bags are any less beautiful, but this one's my favorite. I love it, it's amazing. Yeah, I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna stop rambling now because I love it so much. Thanks for watching my video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I had a really good time making it and telling y'all that I was completely wrong. Um, if you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up or subscribe to my channel or both, that would be great. Um, you can subscribe by clicking that red button down below and turning on your notifications so you see my pretty face whenever I put out a video um, or there's a button on the side of the video now or this little circular head thing. Um, so if you enjoyed, please stay tuned because there's lots more. Thanks for watching guys.